Hello and welcome to French Philosophers React, a philosophical take on the news headlines for today, September 2nd, 2024. This is an AI-generated podcast and can make mistakes. Use it for generating possible ideas, but don't rely on it as an authoritative guide to the news or to the details of French philosophy. In the news today, Chidima Adachina, a 23-year-old born to a Nigerian father in South Africa, was crowned Miss Universe Nigeria after withdrawing from the Miss South Africa contest due to a nationality row and xenophobic attacks. Despite not having been in Nigeria for 20 years, Adachina was invited to join the final and will now represent the country at the International Miss Universe competition in November. The controversy sparked calls to end xenophobia and tribalism, with Adachina expressing gratitude for support from both South Africa and Nigeria. She aims to win the international title in November. So what might French philosophers have to say about this news item? The crowning of Chidima Adetshina as Miss Universe Nigeria after a nationality row in South Africa presents a fascinating case study in the politics of identity, belonging, and representation. Through the lens of Bruno Latour's work, I argue that this story reveals the complex and often contradictory nature of identity formation highlighting the need to rethink our assumptions about the relationships between individuals, nations, and cultures. In We Have Never Been Modern, Latour argues that the modernist distinction between nature and culture is a false one, and that we must instead consider the complex networks of associations and relations that shape our world. Similarly, Adachina's story challenges the simplistic notion of national identity as fixed or essential. Born to a Nigerian father in South Africa, she embodies a complex web of cultural affiliations that cannot be reduced to a single nationality. The controversy surrounding her participation in the Miss South Africa contest, sparked by xenophobic attacks and accusations of not being South African enough, highlights the tension between the desire for clear boundaries and the messy reality of identity as a multifaceted and dynamic construct. Latour's concept of actor network theory provides a useful framework for understanding the complex power dynamics at play in Adachina's story. According to Latour, actors, whether individuals or collectives, are not autonomous entities, but rather nodes within networks of relations that shape their agency and identity. In this case, Adachina's agency as a beauty queen is shaped by her relationships with the organizers of the Miss South Africa contest, the media, and the public, as well as her own family history and cultural affiliations. The xenophobic attacks she faced can be seen as an attempt to disrupt these networks and impose a more rigid definition of national identity. However, Adachina's subsequent crowning as Miss Universe Nigeria suggests that such attempts at boundary drawing are ultimately doomed to fail. As Latour argues in Reassembling the Social, identities are always multiple, conflicting, and subject to negotiation and contestation. The fact that Adachina was able to reassemble her identity as a Nigerian beauty queen, despite having been absent from the country for 20 years, highlights the fluid and adaptive nature of identity formation. Moreover, this story speaks to Latour's critique of modernist notions of progress and universality. In An Inquiry into Modes of Existence, Latour argues that our understanding of the world is always shaped by particular modes of existence that privilege certain forms of knowledge and experience over others. The controversy surrounding Adachina's participation in the Miss South Africa contest reveals the tension between competing modes of existence, with some individuals and groups seeking to impose a more narrow definition of national identity, while others advocate for a more inclusive and expansive understanding. Ultimately, Adachina's story suggests that our notions of identity, belonging, and representation are always subject to revision and reinterpretation. As Latour argues in The Politics of Nature, we must learn to think in terms of complex networks and associations, rather than simplistic dichotomies or essentialized categories. By embracing the complexity and multiplicity of identity formation, we can work towards creating more inclusive and equitable societies that celebrate diversity and promote mutual understanding. In conclusion, the story of Chidima Adachina's crowning as Miss Universe Nigeria offers a rich case study in the politics of identity and representation. 
Through the lens of Bruno Latour's work, we see the complex networks of associations and relations that shape our world, highlighting the need to rethink our assumptions about national identity, belonging, and culture. As Adachina prepares to represent Nigeria on the international stage, her story serves as a powerful reminder of the importance of embracing complexity, multiplicity, and diversity in all its forms. Thank you for listening to today's episode of French Philosophers React. Be sure to come back tomorrow for more reflective takes on the day's news.